Assalamu alaikum viewers. I hope everyone is fine, safe and sound. My name is Muhammad Zishan and you are watching Electra with MZ YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss impedance triangle and analysis in case of RC series AC circuit. As we discussed in our second last video, in our previous videos, impedance triangle in case of RL series AC circuit, but here we discuss the impedance triangle in case of RC series AC circuit. The concept is same, only a minor difference exists in case of RC series AC circuit. So before going to start our today's lecture, please like, share and subscribe Electra with MZ YouTube channel and press the bell icon so that you will get notification of my upcoming videos on time and watch this video completely so that you will don't face any sort of confusion regarding this topic okay so let's start impedance triangle so impedance triangle is the triangle which is used to find out is the procedure for finding impedance Z in case of RC series AC circuit series AC circuit because Z is equal to R square plus XC whole square okay used to find out power factor cos phi is equal to resistance over impedance used to find out phase angle phi phase angle phi i tangent phi is equal to minus xc beta r ok so as we know that the phasor diagram for RC series AC circuit is this is the V of R this is the VC and this is the V so we know that VR is equal to IR V is equal to IZ and VC is equal to minus IXC okay so by dividing dividing each side of the phasor phasor diagram by i we get i r divided by i is equal to r i z divided by i is equal to z and minus i x c divided by i is equal to minus x c so the above phasor diagram becomes will becomes the impedance diagram or impedance triangle okay because here is the phase angle phi okay so this is the impedance triangle which is used to find out the impedance of the circuit power factor and phase angle phi of that circuit okay so once we get 
the impedance of the circuit we can easily find out the power factor as well as the phase angle phi okay because tangent phi is equal to minus x c over r and phi is equal to tangent inverse x c over r this negative sign only shows that current i leads voltage by 90 degree okay just it is the general practice to draw the impedance triangle okay while analyzing while analyzing an AC circuit okay so these are the key points which force us to draw an impedance triangle so I hope you enjoy today's video on impedance triangle so like share and subscribe Electra with Android YouTube channel and if you have any confusion regarding today's lecture so you will you may ask questions in the comment section of this video so also press the bell icon so that you will get a notification of my videos upcoming videos on time and of lecture so stay safe stay at home Allah Hafiz